Okay, Vaskar, let's proceed ahead with your mock for Gas Authority of India Limited and we start with your brief introduction. Okay, Please sir. proceed ahead. Good evening, sir. I am Bhaskar Bachar, final year student of chemical engineering from Jadavpur University. I belong to Kolkata. I have done my schooling in Kolkata only. And this year in GATE Chemical Engineering, I have secured All India Rank 9. And I like playing and watching cricket. Okay. So, uh, Vaskar, uh, what were your college extracurricular activities? Sir, uh, uh, sir, not uh, I was not much involved in that. But uh, in first year, I uh, joined some some of the clubs like science clubs and other some activities. But uh, in uh, last two years, I was not involved in such kind of any activities. Mm. Okay, so. Uh... Any other uh, placement company could you get from your college? Yes, sir. I was uh, placed at Haldia Petrochemicals Limited from my college. So you will not join that? Uh, no, Is sir. It? I am not planning to join that. Why? Sir, actually, I am uh, interested in the public sectors because I think that in public sectors, I will get much more opportunity to uh, explore in chemical engineering field and learn some practical concepts of chemical engineering. So my main target is public sector mm. So uh, what do you know about Gale, uh, Gas Authority, Vaskan? Sir, uh, Gale is, a youngest, is the youngest Maharatna PSU in India. It was started in 1984 uh, under the ownership of Ministry of Petroleum and Natural Gas. And Gale is India's leading natural gas processing and distribution company. And its other business aspects includes petrochemical sector, city gas distribution, and LPG transmission. Mm, okay. So, uh, you know who is the CMD of Gale? Yes, sir. Sri uh, Sandeep Kumar Gupta, sir. Mm. And any idea about CMD of Gale? Sir, uh, he is a commerce graduate. Okay. Uh, what else? And sir, uh, 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 I don't know much, but I think uh, he's also uh, associated with the Indian uh, Chartered Accountants, something. Uh, Do you I see the board of directors? Uh, sir, can you please uh, repeat again? Could you see board of directors of Gale? Mm -hmm. No, sir. Board of I, directors. No, sir, I'm not aware about that. Any anywhere from chemical background as director of Gale? Sorry, sir, I'm unaware about that. Vaskar, are you aware in 10, 20, 30 years where you will grow in Gale if you join us? Sir, uh, sir, I think if I uh, join Gale after 10 or 20 years, I see myself as one of the hardworking employees of the Gale who will contribute towards the growth and uh, development of Gale and success of the Gale also. Mm -hmm. So, you know different business verticals of Gale? Yes, sir. In uh, which domain do we work? Sir, petrochemical sector, uh, city gas distribution, LPG transmission, and natural gas processing and distribution. What about chemical? Uh, sir, uh, actually, I uh, don't know much about the telecom sector. But do you know that we are in telecom also? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I have seen that. Achha, do you know HBJ pipeline? Yes, sir. Hazira, Vijaypur and Jagdishpur pipeline. It was the first project of Gale and it is one of the largest cross-country projects, uh, cross-country pipeline in the world. Mm. So, uh, do you know our customers to whom we give uh, gas, supply the gas? Uh, sir, about the customers? Yeah, the customers of Gale. Have you seen the gas, the gas station of Gale? No, anywhere? sir. I, I haven't seen. So, so where do we send gas? Suppose we, we are uh, making the gas or we are trans, uh, you know, transporting the gas. Where do we sell it? Sir, uh, uh, sir, the gas is uh, transmitted through the pipeline to the uh, inlet stations, uh, import stations, where, sir, uh, it is uh, going to the customers. Uh, Oh. And who are our customers? Because like petrol pumps, we don't have gas station as per you. Then how does it go to the customer and which are the customers? Sorry, sir. Okay, Vaskar, uh, 
when we say gas what what do we mean by that which gas sir gale sir mainly deals with natural gas and what is the chemical formula for that sir uh, ma ma uh, the major con constituent of natural gas is methane ch4 mm, and cng and sir cng is a compressed natural gas it is uh, another form of natural gas but it is compressed to a high pressure like almost 200 to 250 atm and it is so a cleaner fuel formula? yes sir chemical formula is same yes sir same constituent is same just it is a pressurized form what is lpg sir it is a liquefied petroleum gas it uh, uh, comprises of propane and butane mm, okay so vaskar any idea about uh, you know uh, this uh, calorific values of these gases sir uh, mm, so calorific value of uh, natural gas is uh, more than the calorific value of lpg and the lpg which gale produces is uh, having much more uh, high calorific value than other uh, LPG which is getting produced from refineries. Mm. Okay, Vaskar, uh, no, uh, can you tell me why you should be given this particular chance? Sir, uh, uh, sir, uh, I am hardworking and I am honest and I have the uh, potential to work under pressure with any new groups, uh, group members and I can also adapt myself to any new environment. So, sir, uh, and I have also some, gathered some technical knowledge about chemical engineering. So, I think if I get the opportunity to join Gale, I will be able to contribute towards the growth and uh, success of this organization. Have you ever worked under pressure in the past? Yes, sir. Uh, sir. Have you ever worked under pressure in the past? Sir, like uh, in colleges, I have done assignments in very less short time, uh, number of assignments. So, uh, uh, like that kind of situation I have worked. Okay. Over to you, Nikhil. Okay. Okay. So, Vaskar. Good evening, uh, sir. Please share your uh, good evening. Experiences about your internship. Sir, uh, I have done industrial training in Haldia Petrochemicals Limited in the polypropylene unit. Okay. So, what is the procedure for production of propylene? Sir, uh, in Haldia Petrochemicals, uh, polypropylene production is based on spheripole technology. Mm. And first, there is a uh, catalyst dispersion drum where uh, catalyst and oil and grease is mixed so that a, a layer is formed around the catalyst. And after mm. that, the catalyst batch or the catalyst mud is metered to the pre-contacting pot where mm. uh, the catalyst mud is contacted with the uh, co-catalyst that is triethyl aluminium and donor a silane liquid and in this pre-contacting pot the reactor reactive centers of the catalyst gets activated and after that the mixture goes to an inline mixer where it is where a pro propylene is also uh, mixed with this mixture and then it goes to pre-polymerization unit where encapsulation of the catalyst occurs and in this pre-polymerization unit uh, it gives extra strength to the catalyst and also so what is the feedstock tell me what the feedstock for this uh, production propylene production yes, uh, sir uh, uh, polypropylene production feedstock yes sir propylene is the monomer and catalyst titanium chloride and co-catalyst triethyl aluminum is added and process conditions sir uh, the react uh, the main reactor in which reaction takes place its temperature mm. is 73 degree c and pressure is uh, almost 38 kg per centimeter square. Why so low temperature? Uh, sir, uh, um, sir uh, why low temperature? Yes. Sir, uh, for a homopolymer formation, this temperature is much suitable. And if copolymer formation is needed, we also mm. add uh, along with this propylene, uh, ethylene. And the temper then the reaction temperature is almost sixty degrees. Okay, tell me about your project, sir. Um, uh, my project in uh, my uh, final year's project was uh, assessment on air and air quality index in Kolkata and its surrounding areas. It was basically a theoretical project 
where I had to do a comparison of the air quality before the lockdown and how it got changed during the lockdown. So how did you compare that? Sir, actually, uh, there was no uh, lab works involved. But the guiding professor under whose guidance I did this project, uh, she told me to search from various websites, pollution control websites, and collect the data of particular dates before lockdown and during lockdown and do some graphical analysis. That is how many days were good before lockdown and how many days were bad after lockdown. So like this, it was a uh, uh, graphical analysis. Okay. So what are the different uh, factors you have considered to analyze those things? Sir, uh, uh, first of all, sir, uh, in those uh, compare in the comparison, I had mm. to see the pollutant concentrations, mainly like uh, particulate matter, SO2, and uh, NO2 and other pollutants uh, like carbon mm. monoxide, carbon dioxide, I have to just see their uh, concentration levels that how much uh, it changed before the lockdown and during the lockdown. Okay. So basically it is uh, associated with uh, air pollution only? Yes, sir. It is basically associated with air pollution. So what is the permissible limit for NOx uh, in air? Yes, sir. Uh, yes, what sir. is the permissible limit for NOx? Uh, Sir, uh, uh, sir, I sorry, sir, I don't know the exact data. So, what kind of uh, factors you have considered? Nox, so you don't need uh, any kind of uh, permissible limit to analyze those things. Sir, actually, uh, just I uh, analyze the uh, percentage change in conversion uh, in uh, in concentration. That is how uh, how much concentration the it was having before lockdown and how much concentration. It was having after lockdown that whether there is a decrease in concentration or not. As we all know that uh, during the lockdown, there was restriction in the use of vehicles. So there was so much less. What emission. is new? What is new in your project? There are already air quality indexes there to know these things. What is the con uh, condition before the lockdown and after the lockdown? So what is new you have done? The air quality index is there. No? Yes, sir. So you have done nothing in that means. In your project, sir. Uh, actually, sir, the guiding professor told me to proceed this project in this way. So, sir, I followed there, her. Order. There, there must be some objective, na? If we can know from uh, air quality index, so why should we go for this kind of project? Hmm? Tell me about five products of Gale. What are the five major products Gale are producing? Sir, uh, uh, in, the, uh, uh, petro in the petrochemical sector, uh, there are uh, high-density polyethylene plants mm. and uh, mm. uh, LDP plants. And mm. also Gale is uh, uh, thinking about setting up polypropylene plants uh, by 2025 in Maharashtra and by... Kya hai abhi sir, and uh, sir, currently uh, uh, it is doing a city gas distribution and LPG transmission and uh, in the petrochemical sector, high density polyethylene and low density polyethylene. Bas. And and sir, natural gas. Okay. And what is flow meter? Kya hai? Hazira flow meter. Yes. Uh, sorry, sir. Don't know. Okay. And so what is the difference between activity and selectivity? What? Uh, activity and selectivity? Yes. Sir, selectivity is basically the ratio of uh, desirable product to the undesirable product form and uh, activity. What does it signify? Signify. Significance. Uh, selectivity. Ka. Don't know. So, mm. the, selecti uh, uh, the significance of selectivity is that we are able to monitor about the desirable product which is getting Form. that is we need in main uh, need mainly and uh, yes, how
चलिए एक्टिविटी बताओ सर एक्टिविटी इज अ थर्मोडाइनमिक क्वांटिटी इन विच वी मेजर द इट इज द रेशियो ऑफ द फुगेसिटी कोफिशियंट इन ऑफ द ऑफ अ पार्टिकुलर कंपोनेंट इन अ सॉल्यूशन बाय द फुगेसिटी कोफिशियंट इन प्योर स्टेट कैटलिस्ट डीएक्टिवेशन कैटेगरी क्या क्या है बताइए सर कैटलिस्ट डीएक्टिवेशन सर सिंटरिंग कोकिंग एंड पॉइजनिंग व्हाट इज सिंटरिंग सर सो इट्स नॉट एबल टू रिकॉल Idea. Sir, uh, uh, I have read that, but I am not able to recall it, sir. Currently, sir, in poisoning, uh, it is permanent deactivation, like metal deposits occurs on the catalyst uh, active sites. So, catalyst gets deactivated permanently. Okay. 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 इंटेंसिव जो भी आपने किया है वो इंटेंसिव का स्टॉक क्या है प्रोडक्ट क्या है उसका प्रोसेस डिस्क्रिप्शन क्या है प्रोसेस कंडीशंस क्या है इसके बारे में क्लैरिटी होना चाहिए क्यों ऐसा है है ना ऐसा कैटलिस्ट कैसा हो रहा है घूम रहा है वो तो पूछा ही नहीं मैं आपको कैटलिस्ट कैसा है कैसा नहीं आपको पहले बताना की ये फिर आता है ये प्रोडक्ट बनता है ऐसा प्रोसेस है ऐसा ठीक है उसके बाद आपको एक्सप्लेन करने के लिए बोला जाएगा तो आप बोले पहली बार प्रोजेक्ट का रहा तो प्रोजेक्ट में देखिए चार पांच चीजें जो है उसका क्लैरिटी होना चाहिए कि प्रोजेक्ट का ऑब्जेक्टिव क्या है ठीक है इसका लिटरेचर रिव्यू आप किए हैं कि नहीं किए हैं इसका रिसर्च गैप क्या है आपका कंक्लूजन क्या रहा है और क्या फर्दर फ्यूचर स्कोप क्या है ठीक है ओके सर इसका क्लैरिटी अगर नहीं होगा तो कुछ फायदा नहीं है तो आप कुछ नया नहीं किए हो आप मतलब जस्टिफाई भी नहीं कर पा रहे उसको आप बोल रहे हैं कि मैडम बताए सर बताए ऐसा ठीक है तो अगर ऑल इंडिया रैंक नाइन है तो ये एक्सपेक्टेड नहीं किया जा रहा है आपसे जब आप इंटरव्यू देने जाएंगे गेल में कि ये सर बोले कि ये सर मेरा गाइड ऐसे बोल दिया तो मैं कर दी कि उसको आप अलग तरीके से बता सकते हैं कि कंस्टेंट था कोविड का कंस्टेंट था या जो भी था okay, उसको अलग डायरेक्शन दे के और उसमें देखिए सही से या तो आप सही से पढ़े नहीं है उसको अब ऊपर ऊपर का बात कर पहली बात ये होगा है ना तो ये तो डिफरेंस निकालिए आप कि क्या आप नया किए आप नया नहीं किए ऐसा तो नहीं हो सकता कि ज्यादातर यूनिवर्सिटी में ऐसा मतलब कुछ भी करवा दे रहे ठीक है वो आप क्लैरिटी नहीं है पहली चीज ये होगा अगर क्लैरिटी है तो आपको अलग डायरेक्शन देना पड़ेगा आपका प्रोजेक्ट को ठीक है ओके सर और ठीक है एक्टिविटी सेलेक्टिविटी ये जो बात हो रहा था कैटलिस्ट के ऊपर में बात हो रहा था ठीक है तो कोई भी एक्टिविटी का जो भी रेशियो जो क्यूरसिटी का बोले तो ये हुआ कि आप एक नया टर्नोलॉजी दे दी सामने लोग पूछने के लिए जिसके बारे में हो सकता है कि आपको आइडिया भी नहीं होगा कि क्या है okay. है ना ओके सर का एक्टिविटी होता है ना कि नहीं होता यस सर तो उसके बारे में जब सेलेक्टिविटी और एक्टिविटी का डिफरेंस बोला तो आप सेलेक्टिविटी जब डिफाइन कर रहे हैं डिजायर ऑन डिजायर रिएक्शन में तो एक्टिविटी को फिर दूसरा में क्यों चले गया खैर जो बताया भी आप तो सेलेक्टिविटी बताता है कि कितना कैटलिस्ट the ability of a catalyst to speed up the main reaction as compared to the side reaction okay sir theek hai dono mein catalyst ka role role hai aur activity mein kya bolta hai uska acceleration rate batata hai theek hai acha sir it is a measure of the accelerating effect of that catalyst of that uh, particular rate of reaction okay sir theek hai okay sir aur jo uh, deactivation ka jo hai sintering ho gaya poisoning ho gaya fouling ho gaya jo bhi theek hai kaise kya hai method methodology ka dekhiye uska sintering kar raha hu to aapko पॉइजनिंग इजी लगा तो पॉइजनिंग बता दिए है ना हां सेंटरिंग सबसे आपको मैं डिएक्टिवेशन जब पूछा बताना है तो उसको पूरा बताना है उसको ठीक है ठीक है सेंटरिंग कैसे होता है क्या उसका है ये एक्सपेक्टेड है आपसे इसीलिए बोल रहा हूं अगर ये सब नहीं बोलेंगे और गेल के बारे में जब पूछा जा रहा है तो गेल का अगर आपको उसका लोकेशंस नहीं पता है आपको और 
तो प्रोडक्ट नहीं पता है तो मतलब आपको कुछ नहीं पता है आप ऐसे देने आए हैं ऊपर आपको पी चाहिए लेकिन क्या पी चाहिए आपको नहीं आइडिया नहीं है क्लैरिटी नहीं है उसका मतलब ठीक है तो जब भी इंटरव्यू देने जाएंगे तो मेक श्योर की आपको कंपनी के बारे में आइडिया है है ना एटलीस्ट क्या क्योंकि एज ए केमिकल ये इंजीनियर पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू अगर कोई भी इंटरव्यू देने जा रहा है दूसरा इंजीनियर भी जा रहा है तो प्रोडक्ट तो पाँच बता ही देगा आप क्या नया बताएंगे वहाँ पर ऐसा स्पेशलिटी तो आपका रहना चाहिए क्योंकि केमिकल प्रोडक्ट प्रोडक्शन हो रहा है वहाँ पर है ना तो आप प्रोडक्ट प्रोडक्ट्स के साथ साथ आपको उसका प्रोसेस कंडीशन जानना है आपको प्रोसेस डिस्क्रिप्शन भी आपको जानना है है ना अगर वो नहीं पता है तो आप आप बाकी इंजीनियर की तरह हैं ठीक है ओके सर ओके ओके ओवर टू यू विजेंद्र सर ओके भास्कर सी बिकॉज यू आर इन द कॉलेज यस सर दे आर गोइंग टू आस्क यू योर एक्टिविटीज इन द कॉलेज दे विल बी ट्रीटिंग एज अ कॉलेज स्टूडेंट योर प्रोजेक्ट दे विल बी आस्किंग extra curricular things they will be asking about the gale they will be asking gale ka document please take and go through that document oh okay sir That's very very important for you please start going through that document okay That's sir what they will be asking you and uh, information about gale visit their website like you were not knowing that they are into gale tel also telecom also this question normally they ask because there is a gas company yes so they ask you that uh, where do we sell the gas so fertilizer company which is related to chemical engineering right Like yes, NFL sir. and all, they are the customer of Gale. They supply the gas to fertilizer companies, not to individual customer like me and you, but companies. So okay, those sir. things you should be aware. Okay, sir. Okay, right. Sir. Revise that. Okay. The rest is okay. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you. Sir. you.